Welcome to the House of Kittens, everyone. This is Foodcast, and today we are playing more Creepy Pasta Land 2. Alright, so where we last left off, we were uh, pretty much here. We were just having a long fucking talk with this dude over here, King uh, Razorblade or something. Alright, so we haven't been in this room yet, so we can check this out. Do you want. Oh, we can save here too. You know what? Let's save here just in case. The rake. That's a really cool loading screen, though. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, uh, that's... Uh, the SCP-087, what will we do? Uh, we have no other choice. We have to fight. Oh, great. Now we have a fight scene. Alright. <laughs> okay. We have no choice. Let's fight. Simon, you fight too. Uh, I'm just gonna keep fighting. I don't know what the hell is gonna happen. Really? <laughs> Did you hear that fucking wind screen sound effect? Dun -tun, dun -tun. That should be like, oh. You're almost in danger sound effect. Not a, oh, you got a victory. Dun dun! Dun dun! <laughs> okay. No fooling around, let's go. SCP shouldn't be that easy to kill, shouldn't it? If it was, then holy shit, creepypasta shouldn't even exist. This guy wasn't so strong at all. Let's keep going. Well, that's really dumb to say. What the hell? Um. What are we looking at here? Oh, apparently these are all SCPs, I believe. Did I get damaged? What the hell is that? Why am I glowing red? Energy shield. Alright, you found a Yu-Gi-Oh card at SCP-873. Alright, I will liberate the poison gas in their jails to kill them all. I really would like to see these guys die. Ha 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 ha. You fool, every time you kill someone, you're carrying the sins and the guilty of be that being for you. No matter if you, it's a demon or not. I have a different point of view. I think demons are evil and they need to be killed. So we have peace. So you need to go to the next room. I will work here to kill all these beings. Oh, wonderful. Just wonderful. Can I save here? I didn't know that the prisoner 049 escaped too. Is the king hiding something from us? Hmm. Is that a juice box? There's a radio on the ground. The prisoner 049 was listening to classical music. What are we doing here? I came because Natalie's therapy will begin in about 30 minutes. But what about you? I came to give her a thing that the king asked. Uh. Let me see what this is first. Doors locked. I've never seen what's behind this door. The king really needs to hide a lot of things from us. Okay. Looks like this is going to be dangerous since I don't have a tag team here. I'm sorry for that little girl, but my orders are to kill you. You look awesome. I think this will be a great battle. You look awesome. What? I'm sorry for that too, but your time is up. Oh, nice for bringing the clock tower song. Alright, clockwork. Huh. I have never heard of this person in my life. Dude, I'm gonna die. Like I said, geez, you were pretty strong. At least I will die fighting as a hero, not a coward. Your time is up. Huh? Natalie, please stop. We're not your enemies. You lied to me, Yoko. You said that you would take care of me and give me love, but now you and your organization are trying to kill me. What, Simon, what are you doing? Sorry, Yoko, your orders are from the king. I will kill you all. Stop, or I will turn on the bomb inside. Your body and you will die slowly and painfully. I can't believe Christopher, you too? You should ask yourself, Yoko, if this creature escaped from here many... Innocent people will die. 
I already killed all the other prisoners. You two are cold. I'm disgusted. One day this girl was a human like you. So you will kill Ishii even knowing this fact? You are right. She was a human. No. What you did to her. Don't worry. I just t teletrans... Transport? Just teleported her. To K.O. City. If you think you can save her soul, I would never be in your way. Now hurry, Yoko, and find her. Without you, you can be very dangerous. I'm sorry, Christopher. I subjugated... I've subjugated you. You are a very, really good person. Thanks. The king will be very angry with this guy. Only if you tell him what happened here. I don't think you were stupid till this point. What? I love this fucking armor. You got some style. I no longer think you are the king's pet. Do you want to... Hell yeah, I want to save my progress. That was a really quick way to die, though. Alright. Natalie is quite a strong fuck. What the hell? Did all the lights just turn off? The SCP-173. Oh god, if we don't turn that thing... If we don't run, that thing will eat us alive soon. What? Just look at him. <laughs> what? What are we doing? Close the emergency door now and liberate the toxic gas. Oh my god, that was really close. I think I wouldn't sleep this night. I doubt it. this will, this guy will really die with toxic gas. We should report it to the king now. What the hell is that? SCP-173, are you serious? Why was he taking up the whole fucking screen? Like, an SCP containment breach. Was he taking up the whole goddamn screen? I think not. Oh my goodness, this game is... It's fucking awesome. <laughs> oh my goodness. I didn't understand why he was so giant, though. What was up with that? What now? King Runners, we successfully killed all the SCPs, but I doubt if the SCP-173 is still alive. Yoko, she saw what happened, and she ran away from the base. I hope she will be back soon. She isn't the irresponsible kind. I know that she will be back soon. You can rest now. Your mission is completed. I also would like to ask you a thing. Why you didn't tell us that the SCP-049 also escaped? Because he didn't escape. I feel... I free him. Then you could have add that too. What the hell are you talking? You freed one of those demons? The motive is secret. I'm sorry for that, but... Even being royal knights, I can't tell you to. Now go. It's in order. So the king said it. Yeah, this should be a secret of the royal knights. And the king, but I'm telling it to you because you are the... Only one that believed in CSP. We fought together in the past in the first big atomic war. That time's friends were really important. I also believe in the new master. You saved my wife and my children when they were lost in the battlefield. So, they were lost in the battlefield. Why would they just hope? So I will be eternally thankful for that. The war, the life losses. They create inseparable friendship bonds. By the way, do we have some mission for the day after tomorrow? There are a lot of creatures appearing in K.O. City. We will investigate it soon. Strangely, one of these creatures is a big bear, and I think he's called Fre- Are you kidding me? Now you're bringing up Five Nights at Freddy's for this, huh? <laughs> oh my god, I'm so excited to play this now. This is gonna be way too fucking hilarious. I heard that before in somewhere. This is the end of the demo. Thanks for playing. I promise that soon I will finish this game. This was the chapter one. The full game will have ten chapters and five secret chapters. Alright. Also, you could keep playing. Maybe you could find some easier Easter eggs or hidden items. Huh. Shall we? Well, that demo wasn't as long as I thought it was going to be. Oh well. I'm excited to go to KO City and see Freddy Fazbear. 
I bet his gang is gonna be there too. Hmm. I don't know. What could it mean? Oh, there we go. Knew it was gonna happen, dude. Okay, it doesn't look like I'm finding anything. What exactly are the Easter eggs? Doors locked. What about this side note over here? 049. What the hell does 049 look like? Or was that the one that... Nah. Was it the one that we killed already? 087. No, 087 is the one we killed. An unknown specimen. It was caught inside a bubble. Yeah, that monster. Okay, uh... Doesn't really look like there's any Easter eggs. I mean, a lot of posters and stuff, but no Easter eggs. Guess that's it. Can't really find anything. Guess we'll look at the little Yu-Gi-Oh cards. How do we do that? I haven't played this in so long, so it's... Really weird for me to actually, like... Use this. Oh my god, please go back. Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh cards, there we go. Alright, Slender Man. He is as strong as Blue Eyes White Dragon. Card includes... Yeah. I would like that Yu-Gi-Oh card. SCP-173. You know what? They should make like a Yu-Gi-Oh Creepypasta edition so like you can use these cards. Instead of like using the original Yu-Gi-Oh card, just use like the Creepypasta. That would be awesome too. But yet, they all look highly strong for some reason. That's really odd. Okay. So, is that just about it? Now, here's another card. I can only go left. I don't know what the other button is. Whatever. Alright, if this card gives you to the graveyard, it will come back to the field in three turns. Hmm. Yep. That is about it for the demo of Creepypasta Land 2. So, when the full game comes out, and if it's exactly like this at the beginning, then we're going we're just going to skip this and go to the next part. Because we, we already played this, so you guys don't need to see this again. So yeah, we're excited to go check out K.O. Town in February. And see how Freddy all looks there, and the other gang of Five Nights at Freddy's or whatever. Or are there any other creepypastas unlike Jeff the Killer? I don't know, hopefully they'll see some returning characters, you know. So I hope you guys enjoy Creepypasta Land 2, and subscribe in the outro if you have not. Share this here for us on Facebook and Twitter. As always, stay off the kitten, stay off the cat, stay off the creepy cat army. I will see you then. Whoa, whoa, what are you? You just leave me alone. Well, don't, 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 don't stutter. Then I'll be happy about it.